principle. And it came to pass. And it came to pass. And if the serpent had bit any man, that if the serpent, can I get a whip? The Bible says that not sin bring in our mortal bodies that we should obey the lust thereof. Can I get a whip? But if you've been bitten by sin, Jesus can free you. Amen. Amen. Because Jesus came to free us from our sins. Yes, Amen. The Bible says that if a man been bitten by the snake, Amen. if he looked upon the pole, Amen. Amen. He would. Amen. Come on. When he beheld the circle of brass, he had to look at it now. That's right. That's right. He lived. Amen. 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 Look up. The Bible declared that looking unto Jesus. Amen. The author and the finisher of our faith. We got to keep our eyes on the prize. That's right, that's right. Amen. The Bible declared that when Peter, amen, saw Jesus, amen, in the book. Yeah. Can you hear it? Amen. The Bible declared that he wanted to go to Jesus. Amen. Praise him. And Jesus saw Peter. Amen. And Peter desired to come to him on the sea. Amen. The Bible said that Jesus told Peter, come on. Come on. Amen. When Peter had so much faith and confidence in Jesus, he jumped down out of the boat and went to Jesus walking on the water. Amen. 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 And if all things are going good, we can do any and everything. Amen. Amen. But when the enemy becomes to attack us, yes. Amen, we begin to faint in our mind. Can I get a witness? But if we can lift Jesus up, It can't be about you. It's got to be about Jesus. Amen. 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 The battle is not ours. It's the Lord. It's the Lord. Yes, Amen. The Bible said that when Peter began to see the wind around him, both. Amen. He began to say, "Can't get away." Well, let me tell you something. If we lift up the name of Jesus. The Bible said you draw nigh to God. He'll draw nigh to you. Peter was almost to the point. But when he saw the wind both around him, the Bible said he began to sink. And Jesus, in his own omnipotent way, reached. Come on, somebody. Look at your name and say, reach. Joseph, 
destroy and slay me. Yet will I trust you. Can I get a witness? Praise God. Jesus must be lifted. Now look at your neighbor. I said, neighbor, the preacher is preaching. Jesus must be lifted. If you know that Jesus must be lifted, look within your own self and say, yes, I know that he must be lifted. So I'm going to do my part. Doesn't matter what I done last night. God still know all about me. I'm going to lift Jesus up. Somebody say, why, devil? Because the Bible said, at the name of Jesus, here we need your power. Every tongue should confess that he is Lord. Can I get a witness? They sang a song, say, take me back to the place where I first received you. Amen. Amen. And it's good when someone finds that they're on the wrong road and try to get back on the right road. Yes, sir. Have you ever ran off the side of the road? Have you ever ran off the right shoulder of the road? And try to get it back on the road. Amen. Those of you that have ran off the side of the road know that you must ease it back on the road. For if you snatch it back, you will overcorrect. Can you with me? And you might turn the car over. Yeah, man, when you begin to go back to the side of the road, ease it back. Yeah, Amen. Right. On the road. So if you snatch it back, you might go into the left lane. And here come a big truck. Yeah, Amen. So if you have made mistakes in your life, gradually come back. Don't say no more that you can do. Don't do no more that you can say. Take your time. Amen. Amen. And ease. Come on, somebody. Ease back. Come on, somebody. Sometimes the police are even. Amen. Sometimes you might make a mistake and sometimes I've done it. I've made a mistake and I see the police and I... He just hit the lights. Click, click. Amen. Yes, and I look in the mirror and don't see no brick light. Yes, Boy, I'm happy. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Amen. Yes, sir. Can't get a witness. Yes, Amen. But if we lift Jesus up, yes. come on, somebody. Come on. He'll work out your situation. Yes, he he'll give you hope for tomorrow. Right. Yes, he'll give you hope where there's no hope. Where there's sadness, he'll bring joy. Can I get a witness here? Yeah, man, let's lift him up. Come on, get me. Oh, Send you on for chapter 3. We got to move here. Amen. 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 Pray, I hope you're getting something out of this message. Come on, pray. Amen. Amen. Ain't that right? Amen. Amen. I went to work this week, but there's no need to talk about work. Amen. Work don't save nobody. Amen. Can I get a witness? All work does is put food on the table. Yes. Can I get a witness? Amen. Amen. But the word of God will save you. Amen. Ain't that right? The word of God will heal you. Come on, somebody. Amen. Amen. St. John Gospel, chapter 3, and that verse 12. Come on, read along. Chapter 3 and 12. Listen at the book. If I have told you earthly things. Jesus said, if I told you earthly things. And you believe not? You didn't believe that. How shall you believe? How shall you believe? If I tell you of heavenly things. Listen at the book. Amen. And no man have ascended up to heaven. No man have ascended up to heaven. But he that came down from heaven. The only one that ever went to heaven was the one that came down. That's right. Even the Son of Man, which is in heaven. <laughs> read the book. And as Moses lifted up the serpent in the wilderness. As Moses lifted up the serpent, Jesus said. That's right. And like Moses, Moses. Just like he lifted up the serpent in the wilderness. Yeah, man. The serpent in the wilderness had power. Oh. Yeah. Come on, That's right. And Jesus has power. Oh. Come on, somebody. I don't understand how a man can even preach and ain't got no power. Yeah. How can he say he's a man of God and he don't have no power? He's got to have power. Come on, somebody. He's got to have strength. He's got to have anointing. He's got to have a life living. Can I get a witness here? See how I preach today. Ain't that right? Even so. Come on, son. Even so must the son of man be lifted. The son of man must be lifted. 
lifted up. He, come on. Should not perish? Yes. But have eternal life. This is what we preach. Can I get a witness? Amen. Amen. If I can't get you to see Jesus, ain't no need for me to preach nothing else. If I can't get you to acknowledge that Jesus is the Christ, the Son of the living God, can I get a witness? I can't tell you to put your dress down. Come on. Amen. Amen. Yeah, I preach here. First, Jesus must be in the preacher. In the preacher wife. In the preacher children. In the preacher house. Yeah. In the preacher life. Can I get a witness? I said, thank you, Jesus. Jesus must be lifted. That's right. Amen. Come on, somebody. That's right. Amen. I feel good, mother. Come on. I want to be 70 years old one day. Praise him. Mother Hayden don't have to look to be 70. Because she's already 70. Amen. She can tell us, she can say, Lord, I think. I'm 70 years old. I'm 49. I want to be 70. So do I want to be like Mother Hayden? Yeah. Somebody can't find nobody in the church they want to be like. Something's wrong with you. If the foot shall say I have no need of the eyes, oh, what a mess. Hey, you with me. I ought to want to be 71 like my mother. You know why? Because she's an example. Yeah, man, when she walked around, right, she said, look at that 71 year old woman. How she carried her set. Amen. She said, that's how a 71 year old woman look. Huh? Amen. Amen. Say, somebody told me one time, you're the youngest bishop, the youngest bishop I ever know. Well, that's how a young bishop look. That's how a young bishop look. Amen. Can I get a witness? Amen. Yeah, man. Why? Because we must lift up Jesus. It doesn't matter how old we are. We still got to lift him up. Can I get a witness? Amen. Isn't that right? Read it. And who's that believe in him? Listen at this book. Should not perish. God so, so, for God so loved the world. That he gave his only begotten son. That he gave Jesus. Amen. And who's that believe in him? Should not perish. That whosoever believeth in Jesus. You got to believe you now. Believe. That's, That's right. right. That's right. Amen. The reason Jesus don't work for us because we don't believe in him. Reason. Somebody said, why? Because you can't see him. Amen. We always believe what we can see. Reason. Come on, somebody. Ain't that right? Amen. It's easy for us because we are a generation that have to see that. Yes. Yes, sir. That's why they got road sign, curve. We slow down. Right. Amen. Yeah, man. Sometimes they used to put 35 miles an hour or whatever. Now they just put a curve. That's right. Because we, we can see signs. Yeah. Yeah. Right. Uh, amen. We look at it because we picture it. Amen. Amen. What? Because we can't see Jesus in person. Yeah. Huh? Great. We don't believe in him. Believe yeah. That's right. Come on, somebody. Amen. But Jesus. It's always seen because we have Jesus on the inside. And when Jesus is on the inside of a brother or a sister, we are looking at Jesus. That's why we have to be careful how we walk. Amen. We don't want to give nobody the wrong perception of Jesus. That's right. That's right. Amen. Right. If I say I'm saved, then I'm portraying Jesus. Come on, man. So, when I confess that I love Jesus, come on, somebody. Husband, yes, huh? when you love your wife, you show love, amen. Ain't that right? right? By doing things that makes her happy. That's right. Amen. Come on, somebody. Amen. That's right. Huh? Amen. Great, great. Some of us ain't told our wife across the threshold since we got married. <laughs> Y'all know I'm telling the truth. Yeah, boy, Someone might have been. <laughs> Come on, somebody. 
Amen. It's not a sin to still try. Amen. You might can't pick up now. Amen. But you need to try. Try to do it. That's right. Say, honey, if I fall the while, I'm trying. Don't get angry. Oh, but when you fall in the house, it's all right. But you ought to do things that make her happy. That's right. Batman, when we lift Jesus up, he gets happy. Yep. Amen. 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 You begin to feel the joy bell ring. Hang it away. And we praise him, Batman, while we go through our trouble. It makes him happy. Yeah. 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 Hey, yes, sir. Say, honey, I know I said I was going to buy you an outfit this week. But the car battery died. Yeah. And honey, you know, don't say no more. See what I'm saying? She know that you are a man of integrity. Come on. A man of mark and a man of standing. She don't ask you what you done with the money. Come on, somebody. She know that if you could, you would. That's right. Amen. And that's what the position we need to be in with Jesus. Amen. Amen. Even though we get weak sometimes, yeah. Jesus needs to know that if this brother could, would do this thing, he would. That's right. That's right. Amen. 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 In other words, we don't need to fall just so. No. Yeah, that's right. Amen. We don't need the willful sin. That's right. You understand? Amen. If we sin, don't let it be willful. Come on, somebody. Amen. We need to be able to come back to Jesus. That's right. Come on, it can't death come tonight. That's right. Yeah, man, it can't sickness come tonight. Right. We need to have a right relationship right. with Jesus. Yes. In other words, if we lift Him up, That's right. yeah. come on, somebody. Amen. 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 He'll work for us. Yes, He'll work. The Bible says, "For God so loved the world that He gave His only begotten Son." That He gave us Jesus. And who's that believing in Him? Who's that believing in Should Jesus? Not perish? Uh huh. But have it last thing You don't have to perish today. That's right. For God said not his own son into the world, to condemn the world, to condemn the world, that the world through him might be saved. Why would Jesus condemn the world? Amen. But he never. Bible in the beginning, God created the heaven and the earth. And the earth. And the Bible said the first day, the second day, the third day, and the fourth day, God saw it that it was good. Good. That's right. That's right. That's right. He didn't condemn the world. That's right. He made the trees and he said it was so, and it was good. Amen. 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 He made the seed and the fish, and he said it was good. It was good. Amen. He's in the morning and the evening were the first day, and it was good. So God didn't come into the world to condemn the world, but when God made man. Come on. Man. Mess it up. When God put Adam in the in the garden, Adam was naked as a jaybird. Yeah, man. He didn't know no sin. That's right. He was sanctified. Amen. 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 When he's sanctified, he don't practice sin. Mm-hmm. If sin comes into a sanctified person's life, he'll get it out of there. Yeah. He said, Lord, have mercy. Amen. Amen. I'm set apart for your work. Take it away. So when God put Adam in the garden, come on, somebody. Amen. Amen. He was sin free. God gave Adam a job to do. He said, now all I want you to do, here man, is till the ground. Dress, dress the garden. Dress it. Here man. Can I get a witness? Here man. Then God felt pity for Adam. And he said, you know what? Everybody got somebody to be with. But Adam ain't got nobody. I'm going to give Adam somebody. Amen. That God. God is rich in mercy. That's right. He said, I'm going to give Adam somebody That's right. to be with him. That's right. And God made Eve and she was naked as well. That's right. Didn't right. know no sin. But the serpent came and spoke, and y'all know the story. Huh? Huh? That's right. There were still only two people in the world. Amen. But a curse was given unto them because they disobeyed God. Yes, sir. God cursed Adam and said, now you got to sweat for the rest of your life and you got to till the ground. Amen. And he told Eve that you got to have pain. You got to have pain. 
Come on, somebody. Because you did what I told you not to do. That's right. Amen. That's God talking. That's God. And if we don't do what God said do, come on, somebody. You will get cursed. Amen. Amen. If we don't lift Jesus up, come on, somebody. We will be cursed. Somebody said, well, what's going to happen, preacher? So we're going to have to go into everlasting punishment. Amen. Can I, can I finish here? Praise Amen. Amen. Read now. Amen. So, come on. He that believeth on him is not condemned. He that believeth on Jesus is not condemned. But he that believeth not is condemned already. But if you don't believe in Jesus, you're condemned already. Because he has not believed in the name of the only begotten Son of God. Listen. Amen. But this is a condemnation. This is a condemnation. That light has come into the world. That light has come into the world. And men love darkness rather than light. And you don't want to be in that position. Amen. That's right. Great, great. Amen. If we lift Jesus up, we are walking the light. Well, Amen. Right. Why? Because Jesus is in the light. He's in the light. Can I get a witness? Amen. Ain't that right? Can I preach it? Preach it. Amen. Ain't that right? Amen. Amen. They told me in Mississippi that you preach too much Jesus. And that repentance and, and remission of sin should be preached that's in his name. That's why you got to have the Holy Ghost. Amen. Amen. The Holy Ghost will take it. Bring the word to you. Yeah. Amen. In his name, beginning at Jerusalem. That's right. Amen. You can't preach too much Jesus. No, you can't get too much Jesus, brother. Amen. Amen. You know what, church? Since Sharon, we can get enough Jesus to go with us in the ground. We can love Jesus so much. You know, when we were boyfriend and girlfriend, my wife asked the class, I didn't have to look for her. But she'd be at my class. That's right. Looking in there. She loved me. That's right. What about our love for Jesus? Amen. Yeah, that's right. We should love him so much that he, we take him everywhere we go. Right. Amen. Take him to bed with us. Yes, sir. Take him to work with us. Amen. Living him up, amen. amen. Every day. Amen. Can you with us? Every hour. We shouldn't get so far we forget about Jesus. Right. Amen. Said this time I'm going on with Jesus. I'm not turning back. That's right. Come on, somebody. Amen. Amen. And pray. Can I get a witness? Pray. Amen. The Bible said, "Pray for him that what?" Amen. Because there's a condemnation. That there's right. a condemnation that light like, come into the world. Come into the world. And men love darkness rather than light. Men do love darkness. Amen. Because the deeds were evil. Why? Because the deeds were evil. Amen. For everyone that knows that Jesus, the way Jesus was saying in this passage of scripture, he said, "Their deeds were." Evil. evil. In other words, he's telling you that your deeds don't have to continue. That's right. That's Being right. evil. That's right. So the book said his deeds were evil. Yes. So Amen. he's giving you hope. That's right. That's right. Amen. That's right. You know, Jesus prays his word very carefully. Yes, 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 Amen. He's even didn't come to condemn the world. Yes, Amen. We tell you the world situation. Amen. He gives you a way out. Yes, Amen. You can look back over your life and say, my deeds were Amen. Thank God. Amen. 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 He's in deep. deep. Jesus was preaching. Amen. In future tense. Come on, somebody. Amen. Bringing them up to date. Yeah. Amen. That somebody would repent. That's right. Come on, somebody. Right. Amen. Jesus left hope for the people. Come on, ain't right. right. Amen. He was speaking up today. Yeah. Amen. And our deed were evil. Amen. Come on, somebody. Amen. Well, Evil. Listen at this. Hate of the life. But he's saying now for the ones that don't have a mind to change their life, amen. amen that he that doeth evil ain't no other thing to say but hate of the life. life. Amen. Right. Neither yeah. cometh to the light. Lest his deeds should be reproved. Amen. If they come to the light, that's why people don't go back, come back to church. Amen. The preacher preach strong, they don't, they'll skip next time. <laughs> so your deeds will be reproved. Amen. Come on, somebody. Amen. Amen. Ain't that right? Can I, can I finish it? Amen. Come on, read. But he that doeth truth, listen, cometh to the light, 
That is, these may be made manifest uh -huh. that they are wrought in God. Read. After these things came Jesus and his disciples. Let's go now, brethren. Go with me quickly. I'm sorry. Romans 5 and verse 8. Amen. Romans 5. Yes. And 8. Read. Amen. 5 and 8. Let me show you something. But God com commended his love. God commend his love. Mm. Don't say you got love if you don't have it. Great. 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 If you got love, you're going to show it. Yes, Just like Jesus does. Yeah. And we live him up. Somebody said, I, 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 I can't quite figure this out. This, this portion of scripture said God commended his love. And then this portion of scripture said Jesus. God sent Jesus into the world. Well, God and Jesus is one. That's right. God is a spirit. Yes. Jesus was the man that God created from the spirit to come and walk before the people. Come on, somebody. Somebody said, why did God send Jesus? Well, God sent Moses. But Moses couldn't save the people. God sent Noah, but Noah couldn't save the people. God sent Job, and Job lived a righteous life, but he couldn't save people. And so, when men began to make all kinds of excuses, Amen. Huh? Jesus had to come with a, a sacrificial lamb. That's That's right. Right. Come on, somebody. Amen. 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 Man couldn't have nothing to do with his birth. Amen. Amen. He came through the operation of the Holy Ghost. Yes. Amen. Why? Because men were looking back at Moses, amen, as not being as righteous as he should have been. Right. Because Moses killed a man. Amen. 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 Moses killed somebody. Yes, so the book said, Thou shalt not kill. Yep. Amen. So they look at Moses, he cannot be the sacrificial man. <laughs> God spoke to John and said, go and cry against that great sin in Nineveh. John didn't do what Jesus said. No. He got on a ship and went to Tarshish. Amen. 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 When it came down to Moses, God told Moses, now you stick with these people and blah, 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 blah. <laughs> Moses got aggravated. Yeah. And smoked the rock. And said, drink you, man. Well, he called God people out their names. Yes, sir. So he couldn't say anything. Can't hear it. So God 